Deanna Gaston has been on a tear this month, posting the 11th best field goal percentage in the nation over the last five games. A good sign that her health is finally turning the corner, and she now joins us, the senior from Pearland, Deanna Gaston. I have to ask, how's the ankle? I didn't see you limping in the way in here. You seem healthy. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm feeling amazing. Um, you know, I've been dealing with this ankle for at least a month or two now, so it's been a challenge. And we've been, I've been getting with my trainer and my uh, strength and conditioner, conditioning uh, trainer as well to try to get back, try to get this ankle back. Uh, it's been it's been a long journey, but. I'm back now. I mean, I know you dealt with a lot of injuries in high school, too. Did that prepare you mentally to go through stretches where you couldn't play due to injury? Yeah, I've I've been dealing with a lot of injuries uh, for the past, whew, how long have I been playing? A few years. Since now. probably like, yeah, <laughs> since I was four. So kind of like when I got a little bit older, I was dealing with like me growing yeah. a lot quicker than, you know, normal height. So. It's just I feel like I was trying to get into my body, and so the injuries were kind of here and there. But, um, yeah, the older I got, the more I realized that injuries happen and, like, there's nothing you can really do, and I have to control what I have to control. So It's a good attitude to have. Is that something you pass along to, say, like a Rory Harmon after what she went through in late December? Yeah, I've, I was talking to her about, um, you know, like, stuff that I've been through like I haven't been through like a really significant injury as hers but I've also like talked to her about like how injuries kind of suck when, at the at the beginning but then you you start to realize that you you really want to get back like yeah. when you love the game so much it it's like you crave it once you're like once you can't even play it no more like when once it's taken away you miss from it you, once it's gone yeah like once it's taken away from you it 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 just it, you just get more eager to want to play even more so well as we said you were banged up earlier in the year you come back and then you have your best game of the season so far last week against Houston mm -hmm. I know you had a lot of friends and family there how special was that it, it felt amazing because you know my family and my friends always uh, they've always supported me through like you know the injuries and you know just just being a student athlete and so seeing them kind of made me happy and also like gave me more like motivation to play harder, play, play aggressive and things like that. Well, I, I would imagine it's a nice spark of motivation at this point in the season when you're hitting the home stretch, the most important part of the year. What would you say your role is right now for the Longhorns? Um, I feel like my role is being able to stay healthy, of course, and then also be tough for my teammates. We we all have to be tough, but I feel like toughness and consistency for me is that. So when I I feel like my role is like how to rebound, have to make shots. Like when once I get the shots, I have to be tough enough to make a shot because I am a post player and posts get hit almost every single. <laughs> I've day. noticed that you bang you get you get banged <laughs> up every day, and I have to be able to take those hits and be control and make sure I make uh, shots. Is that something you've taught some of the younger players like Madison Booker, even though she's playing the point now, uh, historically, you know, she can play any position, but she said her favorite is the four. Is that something you're trying to pass along to the younger players? You got to be physical in the post? Yeah, that's a big part of being a post. You have to be physical. There's always going to be somebody hitting you. Even like uh, being a guard, yeah, you, get, you do get, you know, pressured a lot, but being a post, you do get bumped hit, slap, some of them do like little trick moves, like will probably punch you in the gut. You you never know what's gonna happen, but stuff the fans yeah, don't always see. Yeah, they don't they don't always see what's happening in the post. And so yeah, I try to try to um, get her to realize that you have to be tough to play a position like a like a forward or a post because you know you get hit a lot. So well I'm glad to see you're back and healthy as tough as ever, Deanna Gaston. And good luck tomorrow night. Thank you. I appreciate it.